Thomas, yes. <laughs> it's nice to see you down yes. here on the set for The Lodge. Um, you are such a big Disney star now. Everyone is calling you the new Zac Efron. How do you feel about that? Yeah, that's, it's, <laughs> it's quite cool actually. Uh, I mean, this time, two years ago, I mean, I wasn't even doing this, I was still at college and stuff. Uh, and now I have such amazing opportunities. I'm doing this season two of The Lodge, which is incredible. Mm -hmm. Um, and I've done Descendants too as well over in Canada. Um, so yeah, it's it's fun. It's, an, it's incredible opportunities I've been given. And um, reference the Zac Efron thing. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's a very talented individual. Obviously, he's had a wonderful career himself. But yeah, I, I, don't, I generally don't like to compare myself to anyone. I think it's important that you kind of go on your own journey and you focus on yourself uh, and, and you achieve your goals and stuff. And, yeah, but no, yeah, it's a f flattering, I guess. <laughs> I mean, it's for obvious reasons, yeah. right? You're not a bad looking guy, so it's <laughs> bound you. to come, it's bound to come. <laughs> Do you have kind of crazy fans as well that I am get in not, touch with you? All my, all my fans thus far are really lovely, lovely people. Yeah, I wish I could meet them all. I mean, that'd be incredible. Um, but no, yeah, they're nothing but support on Instagram and on Twitter. Uh, and compliments and stuff, uh, and there's a few, a few I have a bit of banter with. So no, yeah. it's it's great. It's really good. Really That's good. Nice. How do you tend to spend your downtime when you're on set here? Uh, when we're on set, we've got a, a games console upstairs, uh, and we play football games and ice hockey games. We've got really into ice hockey since we've come to Belfast for some reason, um, and yeah, just chilling, uh, trying just relax. The grounds are, are stunning. There's there's woods and there's there's greenery and stuff. So we can, you can go for a walk. Um, so yeah, I know it's you can you can definitely fill your time and then obviously looking at scripts and eating. Did it feel that and different? <laughs> well, and yes. Not sleep. You need that definitely. <laughs> Did it feel that different when you went to film Descendants to filming here? Because here, like you say, it's so tranquil. Like. You yeah, wouldn't even sometimes know that you were on a film set, obviously, other than when you're in front of the camera. But I imagine it was different. No, yeah, absolutely. I mean, like you, you see, you see for yourself. It's beautiful. Mm. It's 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 so, it's so green and it's so, it's all very real. So like when we're doing mountain biking scenes, we're out, we're in the forest. When we're doing kayaking, we're we're in this lake, and it's just it's stunning. Um, whereas Descendants, everything, pretty much everything I did was in a studio. Um, but in terms of the people I met there, I mean, I met some best friends, um, a girlfriend. I was going to say. <laughs> uh, and worked with people like Kenny Ortega and stuff. So yeah, no, it was it was a, similar in many ways, but so different in others. Are you allowed to talk about that? Are you allowed to say how nice it was working with the girlfriend? But yeah, it was really nice. <laughs> really, really nice working with her. She's a very talented girl. And she doesn't mind all the female attention you get? No, I don't think so. <laughs> Asking, just asking. It's nice to have a supportive girl. <laughs> no, of no, course. she's incredibly supportive. Of course. She's really, really supportive. And um, well, she's in LA just now, so she's doing her thing, and I'm filming this. Hi. Oh, oh my God! God. Hey. Hey. His name's got a, a, a great voice. Uh, I'll just leave it at that. I've wanted to meet you. Oh, uh, yeah, we haven't met each other yet. Got some lipstick oh. on your teeth.